Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In this video you will see in which direction the price of Bitcoin has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators SMA, EMA and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the Bitcoin hourly time frame, the price moved only slightly to the downside with around 0.4% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 55,632. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 50 and the 20 SMA. If the price bounces off the 50 SMA which is currently at 55,508 it could be seen as a support and the 20 SMA that is at 55,887 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. Important to note is that the price is currently above the 200 SMA, which can play as a strong support. However, breaking it decisively to the downside will signal a potential big move down. Moving to the hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is in the hourly ribbon, so you should see if the ribbon could hold support, currently at around 55,294. Nevertheless, a trend change can be expected owing to the ribbon being compressed, which means that the trend is currently not very strong. Usually, when the price moves to the side, the ribbon is less reliable. Jumping to the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. But it's expected for the price to remain the same for some time because the MACD histogram shows that the momentum at the moment is shifting upwards. You should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. Looking at the three hourly simple moving averages, the current price is between the 20 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 55,100 it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 55,943 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. Pointedly, the current price is above the 200 SMA, which is perceived as a strong support. Nevertheless, if there were to be a decisive downward dip, it will signal a possible big move down. Moving to the three hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is above the three hourly ribbon, which is generally bullish and the ribbon could play as a support, so it is to watch if the price could bounce off it. The current price to watch is around 55,086. Nevertheless, a trend change can be expected owing to the ribbon being compressed, which means that the trend is currently not very strong. Looking at the three hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. Moving to the daily simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 50 and the 20 SMA. If the price bounces off the 50 SMA which is currently at 51,688 it could be seen as a support and the 20 SMA that is at 56,214 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. Jumping to the daily exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the daily ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 49,937. The support should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. Jumping to the daily MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the upside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate for some time and you should wait to see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. 
If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time. See you next time.